In this video, I'm going to show you how to verify your ID on Gumroad. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log into your Gumroad account and then head to the homepage. Now, from there, you can just quickly scroll down uh, uh, the left-hand section of the screen until you find the settings option. Give that a click and then look for payments. Now, for payments, you can see that you can set your preferred payment method or payout method to either a direct bank account, a Stripe account, or a PayPal account. Now, if you set up your uh, bank account, provided that you're living in a country where Gumroad directly supports direct bank payments, then you can fill out the details and once you select the account type, whether it's individual or business, then uh, Gumroad holds the right to ask for the necessary documents to prove that you are the rightful owner of the card that you're using. So in this case, uh, you can search for this uh, Gumroad support page right here, which is the filling out the payout settings and for the requirements of course uh, you must be 18 or older or get permission to use your legal guardian's details then use your full legal name including any middle name and or full business name and lastly you must use a physical address with no PO boxes now if we scroll down a little for identity identity verification for bank payouts this is only applicable for uh, payout methods such as uh, direct bank payment or stripe account if you only see paypal as your uh, viable option you can skip to this uh, option right here in which case uh, if you're using or if you're going to use paypal you don't need to submit an ID or other documents for PayPal payouts. Now, if we're going to stick with the first two options, which is or which are uh, direct bank payments or uh, Stripe, then uh, these are uh, the documents that Gumroad may ask since uh, they use Stripe to uh, process payouts or all card uh, credit card payments They're, they might ask for your date of birth legal name phone number and address a government ID number so just look for the ID number of your uh, government ID and then a scan or uh, image of your photo ID, it can be passport, driver's license, or ID, uh, any valid ID. Now, uh, of course, uh, they can also ask for a company tax ID and business registration document if necessary, proof of home address, this can be a recent utility bill, a bank statement, a rental agreement, or uh, any of the sort, and then, of course, a phone number. Now. The reason why Gumroad asks for uh, these details is because, of course, they have to verify if you are the rightful owner of the payment method that you're using and to uh, make sure that your business is legitimate since they're actually paying someone for what they sell or what they do on their platform. So again, uh, as long as you have these documents ready, you can just uh, scan or take a photo of your uh, valid ID. Just make sure the details can be read accurately and uh, the photo is well lit before you take the photo on your phone. Or you have a clear scanned version of your valid ID. So once you have those, then your uh, preferred payout method or payment method will be uh, set correctly on your account provided that the details are accurately inputted. And that's about it.
That's how you verify ID on Gumroad. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to help you out.